Hello friends, this video on atom and molecules part 13 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Let's take some examples to practice. So we have to find the number of moles of the following 52 gram of helium. See, you have to find the number of moles. So one mole of helium is how many grams? Is the molar mass of helium? That is 4 gram. So 4 gram is 1 mole. So 4 gram of helium is 1 mole, then 52 gram of helium is how many mole? So 52 gram of helium will be how many mole? So let's do the math. 4 gram of helium is 1 mole. So 52 gram of helium will be how many moles? 1 by 4 into 52 mole. You solve this, you get 13. So 52 gram of helium is nothing but 13 moles. And 13 moles is 13 into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. Because we are talking about the helium atoms. Okay. The next is these many number of helium atoms find the number of find the moles from number of particles so we know that 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms of any substance let's take helium here is equal to one mole so if these equal to one mole these many number is equal to how many mole let's see that You can do 1 by the old value multiplied by new value. You saw this, you get 2 mole. So these many particles have is nothing but 2 mole of helium. Okay. Let's take some more. So we have to find the mass of 0.52 mole of nitrogen gas, 0.5 mole of nitrogen atom and these many numbers of atoms. So we have to find mass. Please note in all these cases we have to find the mass. Okay. So mole is given here to find the mass. We know that we know that one mole of element we molar mass in gram of that element that means one mole of nitrogen gas will be how much nitrogen is 14 into 228 grams that is one mole of N2 gas. So if one mole of N2 gas is 28 gram, 0.5 mole of N2 gas will be how much? 28 by 1 into 0.5 that is 14 gram. Done deal. The second is 0.5 mole of N atoms. Please note this was molecules, this is atom. So again, one mole of N atoms will be how many grams? 14 grams. But the molecular mass of n atom will be 14 molecular mass of n2 will be 28 because there are two n here so 0.5 mole of n will be 14 by 1 into 0.5 that is 7 gram please note that n atoms and n2 gas both are different then third is this many number of atoms so we know that one mole of element with this many we know that but one mole is nothing but 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 particles these many particles will be one mole and that will be molecular mass so we know that 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 n atoms is equal to one mole of n atom 
and that is equal to 40 grams right so let's ignore this one part now so we'll have atoms particles and the weight in one equation now and that's what you have to find these many atoms is 14 grams so these many atoms is how many grams so these many atoms will be how many 14 by this value 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 into this value you solve this you get 7 gram and that is the answer pretty easy Let's take some more example here we have to find the number of particles in the last example we found the mass of the whole uh, sample here we have to find the number of particles in a given sample here the mass of the gram is given uh, mass of this is given mole is given so we know that one mole is 6.023 to 10 to the power 23 particles for any iron molecules atom doesn't matter golden rule and one mole is nothing but uh, molecular mass in gram if you want to find the weight so the first thing given is 46 gram of sodium atoms first let's find the number of moles in these we know that 23 grams of sodium atom is equal to one mole Right, the molecular mass of sodium is nothing but one mole. So with this, 46 grams of sodium will be how many moles? Obviously, two moles. Correct? You can do maths. So two mole, two mole is what? Two into these many particles. It is two into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 particles. You can do the maths. It will be one point. Sorry. Or 1.2044 into the power 22 particles, or 12.044 into 20 to the power 23 particles. You can do that. That's first part is done. Second part, same similar, 8 gram of oxygen. So we know that oxygen 16 to 32, 32 gram of oxygen molecule implies one mole. So 8 grams of oxygen molecule will imply. 1 by 32 into 8 these many moles 1 by 4 moles and 1 by 4 moles is nothing but 1 by 4 into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 particles well, this is molecule so I can write molecules only directly You solve this, you get 1.51 into 10 to the power 23 molecules. You can write particles, general uh, word, or you can use molecules. Here it was atom, so I can write atom as well. Then, third is pretty simple 0.1 mole of carbon atoms. So we know that 1 mole of anything is nothing but 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 particles here you talk about atoms so one mole of carbon atoms will be this many atoms so 0 0.1 mole will be what 0 0.1 mole of c atoms will be 0 0.1 into this value what is the atoms and that is nothing but 6.023 into 10 to the power 22 atoms Okay. The question is one mole of carbon atom weighs 12 gram. We have to find the mass of one carbon atom. So we know that one mole of carbon atom is what? 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. And this 
weigh 12 gram. So mass of one atom will be how much? 12 by 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 gram. Solve this you get 2 into 10 to the power minus 23 almost approx. So that is the mass of one carbonate. Okay. The question is which has more number of atoms? You take 100 grams of sodium in place, 100 grams of iron in one place and the atomic mass is given. So to find the more number of atoms, we can just find which has number of higher number of moles because number of atoms is directly proportional to mole. We have seen that 1 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms is 1 mole. So let's find the moles in both case. So for sodium, 23 is the atomic mass. So 23 gram of sodium is 1 mole of sodium. So 100 gram of sodium is what? is 1 by 23 into 100 mole of sodium approximately 4 mole of sodium let's find the moles of iron iron is 56 56 gram of iron implies 1 mole of iron so 100 gram of iron will imply 1 by 56 into 100 mole of iron and that is almost equal to 2 mole of iron. This is 4 mole, this is 2 mole. This is 4 mole that means it is 4 into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. This is 4 mole that means it is 2 into 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. So which one is more? Obviously iron is more because this is 4, this is 2. So iron has sorry sodium has more atoms sodium is more right it has more atoms thank you visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality education videos you can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website you can also get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website thanks a lot for watching